with the news of a double Randy Moss coming this week, this is a perfect time to go over how to get some free training, okay, and how to get the cheapest possible training so you can get this Randy Moss. Here is the upcoming schedule for the week. You can see Backyard Ballers is gonna be coming out today at the time of you watching this video. We have heavyweights on Wednesday, LTDs on Thursday, and then the free agency program on Friday, along with the new Ultimate Legends that are coming out on Saturday. With that being said, we need to grow our training stack that you can see up there. We only have 5,000. We need to get that all the way into the hundreds of thousands, okay? So let's go and break down the best way to get training and how to get some free training as well. The first thing that we're gonna be going over in this video is how to get free training, okay? So free training could be, you can get free training in a number of different ways, but here's the easiest way to do it right now in Madden. If you go into your sets, all right, a lot of the old sets that we have in the game right now are giving you some free training. And what I mean by that is, I'm gonna give you an example here. We're gonna quickly go to the ultimate kickoff. This one was the best one at the moment to do. Obviously, once more people see this part of the video, it's not gonna work as well, but you can go to other sets I'm gonna show you to find it throughout the week, okay? So with this offensive champion, Calvin Johnson, you need five 88 ultimate kickoff players in order to get the 91 Calvin Johnson plus his power up. Each one of these 88s is going for about 10,000 coins right now. So I'm going to put the last one in and I'm going to show you the prices that you want to sell these cars for. Okay, so what you get in this set is Calvin Johnson, his power up, along with five ultimate kickoff players back. So here you go. We got the Calvin Johnson 91 and his power. Up. We're going to select those two. And then you can select any of these 88s. It does not matter who you pick because we're gonna be using it for training. So we're gonna grab, we're gonna grab five of those. All right, and then here we go. You're gonna, first you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna sell Kevin Johnson. So I spent 50,000 coins on this set, okay? 50,000, 10,000 coins each. He's selling for 60,000, 51,000, 49,000. I'm gonna list it right now for 55,000 coins. That's all. I'm going to get 55,000 coins for it, or 56, sorry. Pretty much going to get back exactly what I paid for all the cards. So completely free. It's just they're going to cancel out, along with a little bit of this power up, which is going to go for probably around like three to 5,000 coins most, most of the time. Yeah, about 5,000. So we'll make, make like 5,000 coin profit off of this. Plus, we have these items right here. So that's going to break even. So if we sell the Calvin Johnson, we, we paid 50,000 to build it. We're going to sell his card, his 91 overall card for 55,000. After tax, we'll get 50,000. And then we're going to sell the power for about 5,000 coins. So we're going to make 5,000 coin profit from just selling the power up and the 91. But then we also have five of these. If you quick sell these, that's 2,725 training free. Okay, we actually made free training by doing this set right here. Obviously, you need to be careful when you do this because the, when more people see it, the less profitable it'll become and then you might not actually get free training. So you always gotta check these sets. They, they usually work and then someone posts a video on it, they don't work for a little bit, but then they always end up working again. Okay, and then you can go back and check out other sets. You can go to most fear sets, Gridiron Guardians, okay? I took a little bit of time and I went through some of them to see if there was any free training or really cheap training. In the spreadsheet here that our guy Mark made, you can see all of these sets. These are like almost all the sets in the game right here. And we're gonna see if we can find any profit. So I went through a few of them. I checked out the Most Fear and the Gridiron Guardians. There wasn't really much profit. The training that you got back wasn't enough. Okay, the Most Fear 93s right now are actually okay. So at the moment, Randy Moss was revealed. You saw that card early on in the in the video. All right, he's currently selling for about 105,000, his 93 overall. It costs about 120,000 coins to build right now if you can get all these most spears for about 30,000, right? And then his card is going for about 105 at the moment. Obviously, that will change. And then his power up, the Randy Moss power up was going for about 16,000 coins. So you were getting back after tax 108,000 coins. We spent 120, 120,000, and we pretty much got back 108. So we lost about 12, about 11,000 coins. Okay, we lost 11,000 coins. However, you do get back 5,000 training. If you do the math, do 11,000 divided by 
5,000. That's 2.2 coins per training. Training right now is about 3.5. So that is a that is a profit. That is cheap training. Okay. So there's pos there's possibilities of getting cheap training as well from doing some of these past sets. I went through some of them. Obviously, if you want to use this to go track it yourself, definitely do it because obviously the market changes really, really fast. And by the time you watch this video, it might be completely different. Okay. So use this tool to your advantage and check out the different prices throughout the week. The next tool that you're going to want to use before you jump into buying training is to use MuttGG. They go over the training prices at the current moment. All right. And then that's how you can find even cheaper training. So here you go. We're on MuttGG. You can see we're under prices and I'm under the PlayStation prices. It's saying training cost right now is about 3.54. All right, and it's telling us that the their target price to get that training at the cheapest point is a 95 overall for about 92,000 and under. We're gonna go, I'm gonna show you the market. I'm gonna show you how I filter to find these. But what I usually do first is check MuchEG, find the cheapest training overalls, and then I go and search for those for cheaper than the price that they're targeting, okay? So we can see 95s at 3.54, 94s at 3.79, and then 93s at 3.83. Those are gonna be probably the cheapest training options at the moment. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna look for 95s under the 92,000. We're gonna look at 94s for under 72,000, and then 93s for under 50,000. That is our goal. That is what we're gonna be looking for. All right, so let's go and jump into the auction house. Okay, jumped into the auction house. You can see here we got type, quality, team, program here's what we're gonna start with we're gonna start with the 95 so we're gonna do 94 to 95 overall we're gonna search by newest first okay so i'm gonna switch to newest and then i'm gonna go ahead and go by each position i'm gonna go quarterback and so on and so forth i'm gonna be looking for 95s we said that we need to find them for under 92,000, and then we need to find 94s for about 70,000 or under so we're just gonna go through them look for the newest as soon as i see one we're gonna grab it 95,000 is not the worst thing 72,000 is not bad either. I can grab those for decently cheap training, but we're going to be a little bit picky right now because I did pick up a lot of training earlier. So I'm fine with that. And you can see here, that's all I'm going to do. 95. Okay. I'm going to go through them. As soon as I find one, we're going to go ahead and snag it up. 92,000 right here. There you go. I'm going to go ahead and grab it. That is going to be 3.5 coins per training. All right. And then, like I said, we're going to keep going through finding the cheapest possible prices. And I'm going to be going through these positions. Okay. So let's go through all the positions. That's what I like to do in order to grab my training. Obviously, you're going to need coins to do this. All right. Here's one. Here's a 94 for under 70,000. We'll go ahead, pick that up. There we go. And very, very simple. Okay. So 94s, 95s are my go to right now because I do have the lot of coins. If you don't have a lot of coins, then you might want to go and check out like the 93s, maybe 92s. So 92s, you want to get for under like 40,000 for sure. All right, so you wanna get those for like 3.5, so 35,000 for 92s, and then 93s for under 50,000, okay? So you can see here, 93 for 48,000, not bad. Still a little bit high, but not too bad. But you can just go through each of these positions here. And if you have less coins to spend, go ahead, go here, find some cheap uh, training, okay? So those are your best bets. Why? Why do we need training? The Randy Moss that will be in game probably at the time of you watching this video. All right, once I'm recording this the day before on Monday, and the new Randy Moss cornerback edition for the backyard ballers will be an LTD, and he will be in this pack right here. You can pull it from the 87 plus backyard baller or the 93 plus backyard baller. Okay, this reroll here. There is a chance. If you are looking on how to get a Randy Moss, I'm gonna be posting a, I have a video I posted how to get LTDs, okay? And my my best strategy that I use to pull as many LTDs as I can, I'm gonna link that video right now so you can watch it if you wanna go back and try to get the LTD Randy Moss. But here's what you're gonna need that training for. So if you buy your training at those prices, you'll be able to roll into these rerolls to have your chance at getting a Randy Moss. Hope you enjoyed this video. Go grab some cheap training, go grab some free training with those sets, and I'll catch you with another one very soon.